All right, maggots, listen up. My name is Officer Stevens, and it looks like y'all are going to prison. <laughs> I can already tell by the looks of you that some of you are not going to make it. Now, in their infinite wisdom, the administration has asked me to run you through this paperwork pamphlet that's going to fill your soft liberal hearts full of hopes and dreams that are quite simply not going to come true. But because I'm such a loving and caring guy... I'm going to tell you the damn truth. Some of you are snitches. And some of you are pee-pee touchers. And guess what happens to them in prison? Let me just put it this way. Unless you grow enough balls to fight or your butthole grows teeth in the next 15 to 20 minutes, you're in for a bumpy, messy ride. Do we have any questions? I do. Shut up. <sighs> I can already tell I don't like you and no one else is going to either. I wasn't going to make you sit through this, but now that I'm annoyed, let's watch this quick video. Don't drop the soap. Don't drop the soap. Don't drop the... Don't drop the soap. Hello, my name is Warden Wilson and I came up with this video to teach you how to avoid getting inmate relations in prison. Make sure to pay careful attention, and if you are assaulted, make sure not to wash, brush, or poop the DNA evidence away. Hey, new guy, isn't it your first day? Yeah? yeah okay, but where did you get the nutty bars? Oh, somebody left these on my bunk for me. No! Calm down, Mrs. Freshman's are delicious. Dude, somebody totally left them there so that you would owe them money, and when you can't repay it, they're gonna take your butthole! Wait, what? Yeah, dude, you're totally screwed! Never accept any gifts or make eye contact with anybody, or you could become the next victim of prison relations. Good luck and Godspeed. I swear to God I get stupider every single time I watch that video. But as you can obviously tell, our warden is a knuckle dragger who has breathed through his mouth since his daddy shot him into his mommy's wrong hole. Now that you've all watched that amazing video, does everybody feel properly prepared to spend the best years of their adult life locked in cages with other men? No, I have some questions. Good, I'm so glad that we can all have this heart to heart. But, but... Shut up, Chomo, we're trying to get through intake in time for dinner. Tuesday night is meatloaf. Catfish, how many times have you been here that you have the whole menu memorized? I don't know, enough. Now let's get to the fun part. We're gonna talk about housing units. It looks like... Honaki, you're going to D-Block! Well, I was told that I would be put into PC for my own safety. Oh my god, you're kidding! Are you serious? Yeah, call your senator! I don't care! We don't cater to diaper sniffers around here, Honaki! You can't call me that! You have to call me a map! That was a hate crime! Oh yeah? Go ahead and send a kite to the law library, freak! See how that works out for you. In fact, hey catfish, you want to sell up with Onaki? Oh shit, double trays for days. But I need my food. My mama says I'm a growing boy. Well, you should have thought of that before you opened your baby liquor, freak. Don't worry about it. I'm going to sell you to big country soon enough. <laughs> Who is big country? Oh, big country? He's going to be your war daddy for the next... 20 years! <laughs> this isn't fair! I wanna go home! I miss my anime and my ice cream truck! Aw, don't cry, Honaki! Big Country's gonna take you under his wing and feed you like a mama bird! <sighs> that boy got a hog on him like a third leg! I done seen him pull a man inside out, no hands, just... <laughs> I miss my grandma! Yeah, and I'll bet your victim said the same damn thing, boy! If you wanted sympathy, you should have gone back to kindergarten, not prison, Honaki! I'm pretty sure that's how this boy got here in the first place! Oh, wow. That was dark. 
Kind of like his future. All right, y'all, it's time to go to medical now. Catfish, are you trying to do my job? What do you think, Stevens? I'm trying to get to that meatloaf. Fair enough, maggots. Down the hall to medical. Do you have any pre-existing medical conditions that we should know about? I got the ADHD. Can I get the Adderall? No. I got the back pain. Can I get the Oxy? No. I got the nerve damage. Can I get the gabapentin? No. I got the bipolar. Can I get some Wellbutrin? Sure. Why not? Do you feel like hurting yourself or anyone else? Shit, I don't feel like hurting myself. I might hurt somebody else, but best believe they gonna deserve it. My God, that's relatable. Are you going to be coming down off of any drugs that you'll be withdrawing from? Crack, Crystal, Oxy, Crank, Alcohol, PCP, GHB, 2CB, K2, Bath Salts. Did I say meth? Because definitely meth. Would you like to go to our detox unit? Nah, hell no. That place smells like puke. Congratulations, Catfish. You've been cleared to go to GP. Again. I did show enough. Inmate Honaki, you're next up. Hey. Jesus Christ, what did you just crawl out of Mordor? No, I came from Springfield. All right, do you suffer from any pre-existing conditions? I have anxiety, and I have really bad night terrors. Sometimes I wet myself in my sleep. I have the asthma, and irritable bowel syndrome, and the tilted urethra. That boy needs the Valtrex. He got a scorching case of them herpes. No, I don't. Yeah, not gonna lie. I super don't care about any of that. Do you feel like hurting yourself or anyone else? No, I'm worried that somebody's going to hurt my persons. They keep saying this guy Big Country is going to waller out my butthole. Again, with a whole bunch of things that I do not care about. Are you coming down from any substances that you might have withdrawal symptoms from? No, my grandma says drugs are for losers. God, you're a nerd. Congratulations, Mr. Onak. <laughs> You've been cleared to go to GP. There has to be some mistake. I was supposed to go to PC for my own personal safety. Again. And again, I don't care, and I'll see you back here in medical real soon. What does that mean? Hey. Little tip from me to you, even though I really don't like you, just drop to the floor and try to cover your vital organs, okay, bud? <laughs> I demand to speak to your supervisor right now. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. If you're unhappy with our services today, feel free to fill out this grievance. You can address it to Officer Stevens, wad it up in a little ball, and pound it in your ass! Next! Bet, bet, bet. Next! All right, maggots, congratulations! You've been cleared to go to the happiest place on Earth! General population at your state prison! Yes. Oh, no! Catfish, make sure that everybody knows what Hodaki's here for so they can roll out the old welcome wagon! What does that mean? You sure go find out soon enough, boy! Y'all boys have fun now, you hear? them nutty bars that I left on your bunk? Um, no. Yeah, you did. It's Big Country, run! No!